but I do have plus one luck if I for critical wound. Yeah. So Drew, you should move next so you can get to its blind yeah, spot. So I can make it as well. One, two, three, four, yeah. and then I'll attack. So you roll two hit die, and you need to get six or higher because you get one bonus accuracy for its blind spot, and you miss both. Okay. <laughs> so wouldn't it be? Oh, it would be six, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So one, two, three, four, five. Come on, Nick. And I hit both. It gets twice. In. So what that means is, before we then roll to see if we wound, we then uh, roll for um, hit. Lo we then pull hit locations from its deck to see where I'm gonna hit it. So we either get the mm -hmm. beast's ear or the beast's brow, and then I roll the die dice again. Uh, its toughness is six right now, so I hit once. So I'm going to... You you can choose what order to resolve them in. So I'm going to choose to resolve... You're supposed to choose first. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to choose Beast Ear first, because the what these mean is that there's a, re a reaction thing on a failure, or a reaction on a wound. So I'm going to do the successful one on the one that has a reaction on failure, so that doesn't trigger. And then I fail the one that has a reaction on wound, so that doesn't trigger. Oh, I thought you were supposed to choose which one first and then roll. I, that's not how I've been doing it. I think that's how we did it the first time. I don't remember. No, because we've definitely had it where it's like we get a critical and we get and we choose which one we want to apply the critical to. Are you sure? Because I remember when I had two, I rolled to see. I I decided which one I was going to try and attack first, and then rolled I'm to see if I wounded it. Pretty sure. Let me let me check. Um, somebody do the monster's turn while I'm looking. Give me you, Malcolm. Oh, exactly. Oh, so oh, I, monster's I, I, turn. I the bonus insanity, by the way. I did that. No, I did not. Uh, I, I just changed Oh, name. wait. So, Nick, which one did you fail? Um, I failed the beast's brow. And then that says... Oh, okay. Him, so it's fine then. Yeah. All right, so he decides to maul, which says, victim of a grab last round. Last round, there was no one who was grabbed, and that's basically when the monster, it, a grab is when a monster moves yeah, like a, in your path. It autom he automatically grabs you. Yeah, there's also no um, was a card named grab that which we haven't seen yet. So. Okay. Right. And okay. then the one, the next one is closest knockdown survivor. No one was knocked down. And then target what the next thing is sniff, which sniff, if you look over here on the white lion and you go down to instinct, it says the white lion sniffs and ends its turn. I can't read Nick, your hands in the way. Sorry, I was just holding, pressing alt on. Until the end of next round, all survivors are now threats despite any effects that say otherwise. When a le level three plus white lion performs sniff against one accuracy. So basically his turn just ended, but now next turn... Um, he's got plus one accuracy. Yeah. Also, he's a level I one. Been the monster. Line, level three. I should have been the thing, and then, then next turn it's gonna. Whoa. Okay, the monster controller card just flew. Uh, it's gonna be uh your turn, Anthony. You're gonna be the next. Oh, something's my... going. Something's weird with that. Yeah. With what? No, yours is over here, Anthony. What? Every time I lift the monster controller card, it, like flies oh, up oh, into the okay. air. Is your strength turned up really high? No, it's at it's really low actually. Yeah, try it over on the other board. See if it's just like because of the board that it's on. Oh yeah, try something else. See if that does it or if it's just the card. Here, I'll change the lift height. Let me put it up a little bit. Come on. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> was that you or is that? No, just don't touch it. <laughs> um... Welcome to Tabletop Simulator. <laughs> Um, so basically, all, next turn, all of us are going to be threats, which would be then left up to the monster controller, which will be Anthony. Okay. Basically, now it's our turn. Okay. Um, I guess, who wants to go first? Who wants probably to go? Probably the people that are in his blind spot. <laughs> yeah. yeah, probably. That would be a good idea. All right, I'll, I'll just go then. Next Come on, Drew. You need a new pair of shoes. Okay, Malcolm, you're right. We choose one to attempt first. Oh. And then go. Nope. 
Drew. You're right. Drew. Yeah. Drew. Is it what's happening? Drew I failed. It did not work. Okay. All it's okay, Nick. I won't. I won't. Um. Yeah, and just moving forward. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna attack now, from its blind spot. Hang on. Would, would it would it be a good idea to move out of the way so one of them can get in the blind spot? Yes, that would be a good idea. Okay, then I will do that. Um. Actually, Drew. Now let me say this idea for you to move out of your blinds out of the blind spot because then that leaves them to be closer threats. Yeah. Also, if Ooh. you if you just move straight back out of its blind spot. Uh, whenever it targets you, if it does, it'll mm -hmm. trample those two and knock them down. So that's to get to you. bad, I'm guessing? Yeah. Okay. So why? Because like, well, I'm not one, even in its way, two, though. Three, four, five. But, like, if, if he just moves straight back, like, if he moves to, like, here, and then yeah. he decides to, tar and then the monster decides to target him, because two people are in his blind spot and somebody else might be somewhere else, the monster will just turn around and move to Drew stepping on the two people in its blind spot. So would yeah. you be good? Or like... That would be you then, Nick, not me. I was going to move he, out of the way, too. But he's saying, hypothetically, if one of us filled Drew's spot there, yeah. and it targets Drew next, right. then we're going to get trampled. So, like, Malcolm, oh. you would be here. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. I, I see what you're saying. Yeah. I thought you were talking about in the case of, like, what it is now. Yeah, I thought that for a sec, too. No, but then no, I meant at yeah. whoever's in its blind spot. At yeah, the... yeah. Okay, so I'm going to roll to attack as well. Come on, Nick. Okay, I hit once. So we draw hit location. Need to roll five high end, I'm okay. And then I'm going to move out of the way. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, I'll move in his blind spot next. Two, one, two, three, right there. Um, and then I Over guess here. I'll attack. Yep. Missed both. Nope, missed no twice. <laughs> Alright, three, um, no, I can still move. No, no you can't. can't. You already oh, moved. Well, okay. once, right, well, once you do an act, once you do an activation, your movement ends. Oh, okay, I got you. Are you just gonna run away, Malcolm? Four, five. Maybe. Malcolm, you son of a bitch. If he targets you, he's gonna trample my ass. Why would he target me? You're closest. No, Anthony's closest. He's, he's in, in his blind, blind spot. spot. <laughs> oh, am I? Oh, okay. Never mind then. <laughs> it's just the two spots, it's not the column. I keep forgetting that. Well, I would think that if it. Okay, I see what you're saying. Okay. Oh, so oh, so if I was in his blind spot, then he wouldn't even try to get me because he couldn't. Yeah. So there's yeah, no there's no bad for being in his blind spot then. Yeah, not unless he would trample you for some reason. Oh, but he would go this way and then that way. Yeah. Okay, I see. Yeah. Okay, see, I was would be technically, but he's in his blind spot. I I. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll attack him. Okay. How many times can I attack him? Fist and tooth? Twice. And, tooth. All right, and cool. you're an asshole, by the way. <laughs> Why? Running away instead of dealing damage. <laughs> oh, no, I'm dealing damage now. Mm -hmm. Now you are. <laughs> now. That's because I didn't... Safe. That's because I didn't realize Anthony... Because I figured... I figured if Anthony was the only one that was a target, because I didn't... I figured it would be he would turn, and then there. No. Anthony's in his blind spot, I really so he can't target him. Right. I, I think I see what you're trying to do, then, Malcolm. Yeah, I was thinking it would be it would only be Anthony who would be... You hit once. Um, yep. That's tooth and nail he's using, right? Yep. Or tooth, yeah. yeah. Sorry. yeah tooth. Fist and tooth, sorry. Yeah, don't fail, Malcolm. God damn it. This is what yeah. happened last time. Yeah. Um... What do I need to? I need a. You need a nine five. or ten to critical wound, or you need no. You need a six. No five. Yeah, you're five. right. Because you have the plus one strength. Yeah, you're right. All right. So the majority is you not failing. But... Nice. You hit. Seven. Sweet. Six more times, boys. 
Alright, so Anthony, you're the monster controller now. Okay. So I draw from here, right? Yeah, draw from the AI deck. AI deck. Enraged. Uh, when this so comes this, into this moves over to the mood trait slash mood. Oh, okay. So it's enraged. I have to pick another one. Okay. So when this comes in play, draw AI card. While enraged is in play, White Lion gains plus one damage token per monster level. Uh, so it takes. Where is the damage? One. Yeah, okay. that one. So he gains plus one damage. Okay, so draw another, draw another AI, right? When a survivor suffers any dismembered, severe injury, killed this card. Okay, yeah. So now you draw another AI. Yeah. All right. Five more times, boys. That's the wound deck. I'm sorry, I was all the way. Eyes up. Pick target. Random threat in field of view. No target, Seth. So pick a random target. Yeah, so either me or Drew. Uh, so I, I pick? Yeah, you pick. Either me or Drew. Uh, I'm gonna flip a coin real quick, hold on. There are two die that match our colors if you want to roll those. Okay, sure. Um... Pick. Okay. They're the blue and the white ones. And he's oh, not so really he's picking, picking though, is he? I guess flipping a coin isn't picking either. Yeah, it's not. So, so... You, is, are the higher or the lower ones gonna be picked? Okay, I gotcha. Anthony, is the highest or the lowest one gonna be picked? The, you should, how about you roll it and then you decide? Highest one's gonna be picked. Highest one's gonna be picked. <laughs> yeah. Alright. So, Nick, you're getting hit. Alright, so he turns to face oh. me. Watch it. Uh oh. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three. I'm diagonal from him, Malcolm, but he can't face this way, so... I know, I was just wondering yeah. with which... Neither. So, Anthony, you need to, you need to finish the card. The action? So yeah. This one? Yeah. Uh, intimidate target. The monster... Move, like, blue. Uh, who's blue? I can't see the card. Well, I can just do this. Uh, the monster yeah. steers down its prey. Turn, into, turn to face target and roll 1d10. Okay, on a result of 4+, plus, the target suffers 1 brain damage per monster level and is knocked down. Okay, okay. So, so, just roll, roll 1d. Yeah, roll 1d10. Alright, I suffer 1 brain damage and I'm knocked down. And I had 1 insanity, so... That's 0 insanity. <laughs> and I'm knocked down. Okay, oh, All shit. Right. Our turn. That's an interesting way of being knocked down, Nick. I mean, there's no way um, he's like to turn me half over, so... I'm gonna right, move. Let's move to his blind spot, yeah, let's move. Let, 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 no, 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 I have to finish, oh, let me on, finish my turn. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Holy shit. That's all you do, Malcolm. This isn't, this isn't through the gray. Malcolm, we're, we're a team. <laughs> um... Ah, uh, miss. Yeah, you miss both. More rigged than that's good. Now you can move. Now you can try and attack. Right. One, two, three. I mean, are you allowed to just like interrupt someone's turn? Only if you're spending survival action. Okay, come on, baby. Come on. Yes. Hit bolts. Oh. yes. oh, never mind. Ah. Alright, so we got, uh, the attacker is caught in the White Lion's ruse and is savagely mauled. Oh, fuck, I'm down then. <laughs> so he oh, turns to face you. Uh, perform basic action, target the attacker. Doomed. You may not spot, uh, spend survival until the end of this card is resolved. Um. Yep, so. I'm glad I missed. Yeah, yeah. So. Although if I hit once, I would have been fine. Yeah, of course, so, when I fucking hit. <laughs> so Anthony, you uh, so the basic is on the back of the card. So follow this because you're still the monster controller. Oh, and you also gain one insanity because you're being targeted. That's, that's okay. I, I gave you insanity. Okay, so uh, what did I have to roll? Yeah. 
Roll two dice. Roll both. Speed of two. Accuracy of yeah. two plus. And it has a damage of two because it has the plus one damage token. So it hits both. So now you need to roll two hit location die. This goes back in there? Yeah, it shuffle reshuffles the hit location deck. It's really stupid. Yeah, so you get hit in the body four times. Oh shit. Yeah. So move your two uh so you're knocked down because you have it took a heavy wound. Put that to my body for the tokens? Yeah, your two tokens to the body. And then roll the D10. So light first, then heavy. Light. Wait, Nick. Oh yeah, you could dodge one if you wanted. No, he can't. Oh yeah, he's doomed. Never mind. You can't. You can't. <laughs> um, wait. And roll a D10. Yeah, and then roll one D10. How many da is it? One damage. One thing of four or two separate attacks. It's two separate attacks. Of two damage each. Yeah, two separate of two damage each. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you rolled a nine, then we come over to all of the all of the tables, which are over to the left. Over here. Mm -hmm. And then you go to the severe injury table and find the body. Body. And you look go at to nine. nine. Laughs long. You can't catch a breath. Gain minus one movement token, gain one bleeding token. Damn. Okay, so, so it's not that bad because tokens are temporary. So you're green. So you gain minus one movement, and you gain one bleeding. Uh, if you gain five bleeding, you die. Okay. But so you can only move four for the rest of this com of the showdown, Anthony. Okay. Should we just have it there, or just? No, because this is its permanent without any modifiers. So his okay. base is five minus one, or minus one. <sighs> All right, so um, you guys drew. Now. Oh wait, wait, wait. What? 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 Um, never mind. I guess it was the same thing. He actually does three damage though. No, he does two. Because the base damage is one, and then I add oh. one plus one damage. Oh, you already did that. Okay, never mind. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. I thought it was two to begin with. Never mind. Oh. Sorry. Okay, uh, Drew. Okay. I think you can still move. Yep, I'm we gonna go. move the blind spot. Oh, and nice. I guess attack. Okay. Andrew, avenge me. Avenge me. Nick and I. Nice. Nice, Drew. Nice it's another clever oh, boy. Oh, no, it's too crap. Are you shuffle even the discarded hit location? Yeah. Because otherwise, otherwise the oh, traps okay. would uh. Alright, uh, so you hit two. Yeah. Which one do you want to go for first? Um, I would recommend the soft belly, because Beast's Paw has yeah. reaction on failure. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Hang on, what do I do now? Just roll so it down. Just roll, roll for the one, one soft ten. belly, and then roll one for the beast Paw. Yeah. But do the soft belly first. Oh, critical yeah. wound. So, a lantern 10 is a critical wound. So, you gain one random light, li light line resource. Malcolm can you read the rest of it. You gain one random white line resource. Um, he now has a persistent injury. Organ trail, the white line intent intestines. Nick, move your hand. Hang from the wound on its gut, dragging on the floor. At the start of every monster turn before it draws an AI card, roll 1d10. On a result of a 1, the monster suffers one wound. Wow. Sweet. That's good. So what do you get as a resource? So, or are you spying it now? So draw a white line. Do resource. I draw that? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, cool. You get a white fur. White fur? Sweet. Nice. Nice. Alright. Oh, this is the one that got me. Oh, oh. yeah. You, you might get fucked on this one, Drew. Hang on. So what, what do I have to roll? For uh, you need to roll same, just... a five. Same thing. Yeah, you need to roll six, so five or higher. Well, there goes nothing. 